Hey guys, it's Daniel. The following is a clip from my interview with Randy Backman. This interview was for my documentary, What is Classic Rock? If you want to see the full documentary or the full interview, the links are available below. Thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe for more. Also, everything was done then in real time. There's no click tracks with a real band who actually rehearsed before they went into a studio and learned some original songs and just went in and jammed the song out and took it three or four, five takes and picked the best take. And if you could, if it wasn't mono, if it would progress to stereo um, or four track or six track or 16 track, you can go back and fix um, a bad solo or a bad lyric or a bad note or something. Other than that, you took the best performance with mistakes and everything and released it. But it was the performance that made those records great. You listen to an old record now on, a, on a Atlantic or Sun or one of the old labels from the you know, late 50s through the 60s and 70s. It was just guys rocking out in the studio. It was also done on tape, which made a real difference to the sound.